Hey, good morning. So last night uh, I was doing a little research and I seen that Ford pretty much released a new uh, a new Roush for 2019. It's gonna be 710 horsepower. So um, I was curious. I want to do a little quick little video on it. So I gotta head to work. Let's get it. Let's get it going. is finally releasing some of uh, another model to the Mustangs uh, 5.0s. Um, it's not really a, I wouldn't say a Ford release, I, it's a Rouse edition obviously. So um, what I was seeing last night, I was reading up on it last night, it's going to be a Rouse, it's going to be a RS3 uh, model and it's going to have 710 horsepower. So that's gonna be a stage three kick, um, 700 with a Whipple charger on it, or a supercharger on it. And it's gonna have 710 horsepower, which is cool. Finally, Ford, finally, catching up to the Hellcat. They're trying to keep up. Four years later, they're finally making a car in the sevens, but still, even from factory, um, it's still not factory. It's still not a, in my opinion, it's not a factory built car, so. Um, good try though, but it is going to be released on in October, I believe. The orders for it start on the first, which I believe is which is tomorrow. So, if you're looking for this uh, RS3 uh, Rouse Edition Stage Three kit, um, 710 horsepower. It goes on pre-order tomorrow. So, just had to do a quick video. Make sure y'all don't miss out on it for those four fans. It does look nice. I like the body style of it. It looks good. Um, it's coming with a different body kit on it. Um, it has a few other options as well. Now, again, I like it. Like, I have nothing against Mustang. I have nothing against Ford. But I feel like they should have bended this 700 horsepower car just because Dodge's been doing it for the last four years, man. So, and now, now Dodge is up into the eights, man. So, hopefully, Ford makes a big comeback with this uh, GT500. Uh, so it, it, it better be seven, no, no, no less than 750. Nothing less than 750 because they were talking so much trash about how Venom kills demons on uh, YouTube. So it better be nothing less than 750 if you want to compete, man. Because night, the stock Hellcat for 2019 is seven. Uh, 717 and then the red eye is 797 and then you got the demon that's out that's got 808 and then it's 840 with uh, race gas or so race fuel so i don't know hopefully i step your game up for it that's all i'm saying but that's all i got for y'all today man um hopefully i enjoyed the video i want to know man if you're gonna pre-order this uh rs3 uh roush mustang or not let me know if you're gonna uh, pre-order it i'm curious what it's gone how it's gonna perform 710 horsepower that's a lot of horsepower in a mustang so you know i just think <laughs> hopefully hopefully no more not well shit we already know it's gonna be more opportunities to hit more crowds with 710 horsepower so that's that's a given But um, hopefully, man, people people don't run into more crowds or more power. So, but um, appreciate y'all for watching this quick little video. Um, like it. Let me know if y'all like this this new Roush uh, RS3 2019. Let me know if y'all like it. What y'all think? How it's going? What it's, what it's gonna sell for? I didn't see a price release for it. Um, they said that it was gonna the starting package for it was gonna be at twenty two thousand. So. We'll see what the, you know, if you add it on to your base 5.0, it's an extra $22,000. Or if they were saying the base RS3 was going to be $2,000. So, or $22,000. So, we'll find out. Like I said, pre-order start, I believe, tomorrow. Today is, today is the 31st. Pre-orders do start tomorrow. So, tomorrow's Saturday. Pre-order start tomorrow, September 1st. So don't miss out on the pre-order if that's it. If you're looking for one, if you've been waiting on this Roush, uh, it's for you, man. 710 horsepower. It's a lot of it's a lot of power in the Mustang. So um, get on them, man. I can't wait till I see one out on the road. But that's all I got for y'all.
y'all today, man. Just a quick little update. What's going on with Ford? I try to get as many videos as I can up about upcoming cars, uh, upcoming leases, and all that good stuff. Who has the best lease deals? More videos to come, though. So make sure you don't miss out. But that's all I got for y'all today, man. Peace. I'm out.